Right, just gonna disconnect the uh, brake, uh, brake lines, clutch, master cylinder, and uh, the fuel pipes. Um, so I can't take the fuel pipes out until I've got the sub drains out. So yeah, I'm gonna get them disconnected uh, and all drained down. So what, 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 what? Losing all of our faith, we can't live this way. Feel me slowly fade away. do anything else uh, so, uh, I'm gonna start taking the interior out uh, so I'm waiting for the pump to uh, degas uh, the hydroelastic suspension um, so I've got nothing else I can really do everything's disconnected ready for the subframes to come out um, so yeah I'm getting seats in that out door cards carpets um, and then probably about an hour and I'm done for the day That's all stripped out. Um, I've just got the dash in that to do, which I'm not going to do today. Um, I'll show you the seats and stuff in a minute. Um, I'm just going to show you around the inside of the car, um, which shows the issues with the seals. Um, I don't understand some people really. Obviously, it's had a restoration, um, I think, yeah, 96, 97. So, Initially, you know, the floors, um, and seals are not bad on the inside. Floors are very good. Um, I think they're very good on the outside as well. I mean, generally inside, even the paintwork is is pretty good still. So uh, the plan is probably not to spray the inside, other than making good any sort of repairs where I do the seals and stuff. 
that's the plan anyway. So, you know, for, for a, what was it, 50 year old car, um, it's dry here. Um, it's not, these are actually okay. Um, I'll know more when I get it blasted and it'll show where it's had welding um, and not. Um, but you can see it's it's not great there. It's definitely had an inner seal repair. You can see the join there. That would never have been like that. Um, there's a little weld there. I don't know what that's about. Um, but let's see if I can get in there so you can see. So you can see that rather than replace the seals, they've left the rubbish bits in there and just put over seals on, which is a usual thing. Um, hopefully, it doesn't look too bad at this end um, near the hill board, so fingers crossed um, it's salvageable of sorts. Um, so that's not great. Um, so everything underneath looks okay from the eye. But again, you've got the same thing here. Um, just why do they do it? You know, just at the very least you cut the rust out. Uh, even if you don't want to go to the expense of replacing the seals completely, just cut the rust out, you know? It's just madness, absolute madness. Uh, you can see there's some sort of welding marks there. Um, so I don't know what that's about. A little bit of damage there. What well, looks like rust, maybe. Uh, so I need to look at that. But, like I say, everything else looks pretty good, really. Um, oh yeah. Sorry. So, this side is really bad. Um, you can see, I could probably, oh, there's my screwdriver. I ain't got my screwdriver in here. Um, I can probably put my screwdriver through there. I already did put my screwdriver through there. I did an MOT, uh, MOT test on it and uh, yeah, screwdriver straight through. So it's definitely seals on this. It, it looks like it may have even had inner seals at some point, uh, just been done badly. So um, fingers crossed it's not come too far onto the floor, because uh, what I don't really want to do is start cutting out um, to, the, I think it's the first flute in it. So the joint will be there. Um, bit of surface rust there, but that'll just be surface rust. Obviously it's got the floor plate there, but you can't actually see what the number is. I'll try and find out what that is. But yeah, generally it's okay. It's pretty good. It's just annoying with the seals, really. Um, so I'll know much more once I um, get it blasted. Um, but I'm not going to get the inside blasted. It'll just be the outside. Um, yeah, so that's a wrap for today. Um, next one will either be... on the outside and see what I've got it. Sorry. <clears throat> you can see it's well gone all the way along. Such a shame. Looks like it's had a repair there. Yeah, it's definitely had a repair there. Uh, the other side's not so bad on the underside, but.
Yeah, so that's it for today. Um, I'll show you, I, I, I need to clear a load of stuff, move a load of stuff around. So I'll show you the seats and that uh, next time. Um, I've got uh, quotes to do, so. Yeah, uh, so next time I will have the um, pump for the hydroelastic so I can get the subframes dropped um, out there. Um, and then I'll then start taking all the dash bits out and all this stuff out here. Uh, then it's just bumpers, windows, and away we go. Um, yeah, all right, see you next time.